Today we're going to be talking about area and perimeter. Area is the measure of the amount of space on the surface of an object. Area is expressed in units squared, such as square feet or square yards. The formula for finding area is area equals length times width. We use area when we want to know the size of a surface. For example, I want to put carpet in my bedroom, so how much carpet do I need? Or, I want to put new tile in my bathroom, how much tile do I need? Perimeter is the measure around the outside edge of an object. Perimeter can be found using a few different formulas. For example, perimeter equals the length plus the length plus the width plus the width. Or, perimeter equals 2 times length plus width. Or, perimeter equals 2 times length plus 2 times width. We use perimeter when we want to know the distance around the outside of something. For example, I want to put a fence around the outside of my garden, so how much fence will I need? Or, I want to build a rabbit cage, how much wood will I need for the outside? Let's look at a few examples. You are building a doghouse for your dog's spot. It will be 8 feet long and 6 feet wide. Your dog wants a soft floor, so how much carpet will you need? How much wood will you need to build the walls around the outside? Let's try our formulas for area and perimeter. First, how much wood will you need to build the walls around the outside? Since we're talking about the outside of the object, we're going to use the formula for perimeter. In this case, we'll use perimeter equals 2 times the length plus the width. Remember, our length is 8 feet and our width is 6 feet, so 2 times 8 plus 6. 8 plus 6 is 14, so now we're going to multiply 2 times 14 to get 28 feet. We're going to need 28 feet of wood to go around the outside of Spot's house. Now, how much carpet will we need in order to give Spot a soft floor? Well, our formula for area is length times width. So, area equals 8 times 6, or 48 square feet. We're going to need 48 square feet of carpet in order to give Spot a soft floor. Let's try another one. We're going to build a new garden. The garden is 10 feet wide and 12 feet long. To add a layer of topsoil to our garden, how many bags of soil will you need if each bag of soil covers 10 square feet? And to add a fence, how many feet of fencing would we need? Let's do some math. To add a layer of topsoil, how much soil will you need if each bag of soil covers 10 square feet? Well, here we're going to be dealing with area because we want to know how much space is on the top of the garden. So, area equals length times width. In this case, our length is 10 feet and our width is 12 feet. So, area equals 10 times 12, or 120 square feet. But that's not all we need to know. We now know the area but we still need to find out how much soil will we need if each bag of soil covers 10 square feet. Well, we know we need to cover 120 square feet, and each bag of soil covers 10 square feet. So, in order to find out how many bags we need, we'll need to divide 120 square feet by 10 square feet to find that we need 12 bags of soil, because 120 divided by 10 is 12. Now, to figure out how much fence we would need, a fence goes around the outside, so we're going to use the formula for perimeter. We'll use again 2 times length plus width. So in this case, 2 times 10 plus 12. 10 plus 12 is 22, so now we're going to multiply 2 times 22 to get 44 feet. We'll need 44 feet of fence to go around the outside of our garden. I hope that this video has helped you understand a little bit more about area and perimeter and how they can be used.